Hey, what's going on guys? Paolo Barroso, thanks so much for watching my video today on how to manifest things into your life super, super quick. You guys know that I'm a big fan, or some of you know that I'm a big fan of um, LOA, Law of Attraction, big fan of The Secret. Been studying The Secret for many, many years, watched the movie The Secret about a thousand times. But guess what? I have, I've managed to manifest a lot of things into my life and I know for a fact that LOA works. The universe can offer you anything you want. The secret works. But over the years, many people came to me and saying, pal, we watch the secret. And why does it work for some people and why it doesn't work for others? And um, I, th I think the answer to that, and it's missing out a little bit from the secret, a little bit. They touched up on it, but they didn't really make um, a big effort into it and i think the missing piece of the secret guys and the reason why things sometimes don't manifest into your lives or into anyone's lives it's the use of feeling okay let me explain that to you by the way i carry my goal card with me every single day guys every single day and every time i look at it and i close my eyes and i visualize the things that i want in my life i'm not only seeing with my mind's eye what i want but I'm also using feeling. And you guys need to understand something. Feeling always supersedes what you see, what you want, what you visualize. Do you guys get that? Because sometimes we feel really bad inside and yet we're visualizing our goals and seeing our mind's eye what we want in the future, what we want to materialize into our existence, but yet our feeling, our gut feeling is bad. We feel bad, we feel broke, we feel not worth it. And once I understood that concept that we need to feel good because the language of the universe, how it manifests things from the invisible to the visible, is through feeling. I want you guys to understand that. I, I read this, by the way, don't, don't think for a minute. I, I interviewed many, many people who are very successful at manifesting things. So this is not something that I just came up with. Or oh, I read somewhere and it might work. No, this is something that I've put into practice and it works 100% of the times. But you guys need to get this. And sometimes it's not the easiest way. It, it's not the easiest thing to do, to create that feeling. But I want you guys to understand something. The universe is like a mirror and the universe or whatever you want to call it, whatever religion you are, you know, I'm not here to talk about religion, but whatever you believe, so the universe is a mirror that will give back to you whatever you feel, not what you want, not what you affirm or visualize. All those things, it, 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 it helps. It helps to visualize. It helps to write your goals down. Absolutely, 100%. But it's the feeling that communicates with the universe saying, I want this, I deserve this. I want you to make it happen. And the universe, like being a mirror, just gives, gives it back to you. But you need to speak the language of the universe, which is feeling. You guys get that? So feel good because the feeling, the feeling good, always supersedes not feeling good and being negative. Because if you think you want something and you want something so bad and you read your goals every single day, yet you feel you're not worth it, you don't deserve it, there's a conflict there. And remember what I said earlier, feelings always supersedes your wants, your wishes, what you want, what you visualize. So the, vi the, the feeling always wins. So that's the trick, guys. And that's my five cents for today. If you want things to happen in your life, if you want to manifest from the invisible to the visible, use the language of the universe, which is feeling. So it has helped me immensely over the years. I know this works. It's actually proven by science that feeling communicates with gravity, which is the law that brings everything into existence, that keeps everything together in our material world. So feeling, guys, so, so important. And I know this might sound oversimplistic, but guess what? Sometimes the simple things are the simple things that work. So carry on visualizing, carry on writing your goals, but now put a second layer into everything, which is feeling. And then finally, obviously, take action. Because without action, if you just gotta close your eyes and meditate and visualize what you want and use feeling, and then you go to your day-to-day -day life and you don't change yourself and you don't take action, that's not gonna happen, right? You know you need to take action. So whatever that action you need to do, maybe is to um, work on your business, maybe it's to invest in yourself, invest in your business more, whatever that is, visualize, see it in your mind's eye, but most importantly, how does it feel to have those things 
and then the feeling will communicate with the universe bring out everything you want into existence but you gotta take action as well so that's Paolo Barroso checking out I hope you enjoyed this video leave me some, com some comments below let me know if this makes sense guys I love you and have a great day thank you for listening